Whoa! Oh! Just kidding. <laughs> That's a fun road right there. Wanted to do today a short little uh, uh, quick informative video on how to remove the charcoal canister off the KTM 690 Enduro R. Mine's a 2017 model and uh, if you watch my video on the easiest way to remove this bracket for the canister um, watch that or I'll leave a link in the description. So first thing you do is remove the bracket of course and then you can remove this the canister I've, I put double lock tape on there this hose back in I'm gonna try and have everything in place loosened everything up just to make it easy so remove that remove this hose here on the left you can remove this hose here and then there's this bracket here if you can see not a bracket, a clamp that holds this valve on. You can remove that. And then in this little plug right here, there's this spring clip. You can see that, a spring clip. Take that off. Set it aside because you're going to need it. Unplug it. Here's the dongle from Wattweiler Performance, $23 dongle. <laughs> Plug that in and put your spring clip back in to retain the dongle. Easy as that. Then you can remove this valve here. That can go bye-bye. Put in your parts bin box, whatever. Now there is a hose right here that was on the bottom of this valve. Right here you need to remove that also. I forgot to include that. Remove that. This gets capped. Um, cap it with whatever you want. And I'm wondering if somebody doesn't make a block off plate of some kind to. It's kind of tight in there. It's just underneath to and to the left side of the throttle body. Block this off. This little hose here. I haven't quite fished that out yet. I'm just going to cap this hose off. It goes. I believe it goes all the way back to the. A vent hose for the fuel cap so if that is a, an overflow probably don't want that dripping on the engine fuel so I'm gonna cap that off and once your dongles in you can I would probably think just let me get this hose out of here maybe zip tie it somewhere tight up in here or down here I'm going to try and move it in. That's tight. Jeez. There's no room to move that. <laughs> I'd say just zip tie it right there. So if you can see that. Hopefully that shows up in the video. I'll find out in a minute. Anyways, hope that was helpful. Just want a quick and easy, easy peasy. SAS dongle. SAS canister removal and dongle. Thanks a lot.